guys, it's Ashton. And Lurk. And Lurk. Welcome <laughs> to another top five. It's been several months, but now we have tons of new equipment, awesomeness, so we can record. And by tons of new equipment, we mean a mouse, a new computer, and yeah, a mic and a pot filter that barely, that it's falls okay. over all the time. Yeah, but as you can see, you, as you can see a face palm here, this... This episode, this top five that we're doing today is about He's many different face palms. It's, it's about many different face palms. Basically what the it is, the top five most ignored, you could, you could also say useless, I would say ignored, useless. most top five ignored characters useless. in video games. They're ignored and useless. Let's just tie it up. Okay, ignored and useless. Ignored and useless characters. Let me know. And video games. So, let's just get straight into this. Yes, number five on our list uh, is Pichu. Pichu. Um, I know a lot of you may be surprised. Like, I like Pichu. Nobody's surprised. I, I, I like Pichu. I, okay. they, maybe some fanboys are surprised, but personally, we didn't think that Pichu... Sh didn't really need to be made. I think Pichu, Pikachu, and Raichu were already enough. And this Pokemon's kind of weak and underpowered anyways. Not underpowered. He's just terrible. He is incredibly light. Meaning that he has very low defense. If any, his attack is terrible. And he's more of a danger to himself than anyone else. Yeah, it's... Personally, I don't really understand. What? Well, it's a baby. <laughs> Personally, I, mean, I just think that it just adds baby. more Pokemon, gruelingness, so gruelingness onto getting that favorite Pikachu that you want to evolve into Raichu. Do you really want to go through this Pichu stage? I don't just think so. And also, who, if you guys have out, gotten an Alpha Sapphire recently, did you, Omega Ruby. Did, I mean, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, oh, yeah. were you planning to catch a Pichu? I, I think you not. Catch a Pichu. I think did. Was anybody here? Ashton. You can't catch a Pichu. You have to breed it. Technically, you could actually catch one, No, you can't catch a Pichu. You have to breed to get a Pichu. Derp, then. Anyway, let's go on to the next. Number four on our list, we have Toad. Okay, okay. Quick note. We're referring to the Toad that's depicted in the Mario Bros. series. The main... 3D Land, all that stuff. Yeah, the main Mario the series. The main Mario Bros. series. I'm not referring to Toad in Mario Kart, Toad in Mario Party. Those characters or are Captain actually... Captain Toad. Those characters are actually useful in Captain Toad, where they actually made Toad a good protagonist. Um, now, the problem with that I have with Toad is they're the main inhabitants in Mushroom Kingdom. Yeah. Look at all the castles. Clearly, they have enough power in them to... Do all the manual labor required to build a castle. Now, why? What are you doing in the castles? They just tell you for seven out of the eight worlds that your entire trip of dungeon hopping and doing well Mario stuff was in vain. Pretty much, they're just telling you the princess is gonna get captured again. Yeah. I, uh, why doesn't Mario just just tell him, ask him which castle? Yeah, just like pick which him castle? Up and, what castle? Exactly, it's just like, it just sits in the castle, does absolutely nothing even though he built it, and it's his, it's his princess, actually, it's his family, so why doesn't he give a crap about and it? And Mar, let's face it, Mario doesn't get squat. Mario's just some Italian he guy. He doesn't get squat. He just what like, he does, he, he <laughs> likes to get the odd kiss on the nose, or even a friggin' cake. Exactly, he just, uh, exactly. Let's go on to number three. Third on our list, a lot Luigi. of you, Luigi. He has um, had a proper game. He's had absolutely nothing. Except we for, know except practically for... nothing about him except for being in Nintendo crossover games like Mario Kart. And uh, he wasn't in Smash Bros. Uh, yeah, he is. He, well, Mario he Kart have, and Mario Party, basically. He might have been a trophy. Honestly, I, I think know. that Nintendo just kind of shelled it yeah, out. They, tried to they just shelled out, out a character Mario, quickly. Wari I mean, with Mar Mario World. Wario was already like the anti Mario, so yeah. of course they had to make the anti Luigi. Exactly. I I personally think that they just kind of they can't really after they made Wario they can't just like I don't know it's yeah. 
I just to think there's, though, they could have at pre- least... A, he has a pretty cool mustache. Yeah, so he, yeah, he has a pretty cool course in Mario Kart, but they could have said at least one detail about him, his background information, anything. Does Waluigi even have background anything? information? Yeah, we don't even... Actually, this is not even useless. It's just unknown. We know nothing about it. I don't think that anybody knows anything about Waluigi. Going on to number two. Number two on our list is... Magikarp. Magikarp. Uh, I... I know, before we start any flame wars in the comments, I'm not referring to the evolution of Magikarp, okay? No, okay. I'm not referring in to him. Sense, I, in a sense, I understand what you're saying, but... No, but what I'm but, saying is, um... He's water flying. He has a major weakness to electric, grass, and any... Again, right, he has a major weakness. Actually... And even Ooh, once he evolves into Gyarados, once you add fairy types to the game, he's even more vulnerable. Yes, because of his Mega Evolution, which is Water Dragon, admittedly that's the typing everyone wanted him to be. Yeah. And his Mega Evolution looks pretty cool. Personally, but but that's about it. on the topic of Magikarp, personally I think that, yeah, he's... Pretty much, he's useless. Well, I know, I know, I know. So there's the argument days. that he can learn flail tackle, right? Flail tackle, I think it is. No, it's just tackle. No, I mean, that's pretty amazing. Something so tackle, but tackle, kind of tackle you. You can't do much with tackle, to be honest with you. Tackle is that one move you use at about level four, like just spamming it to try to get to the next part of the game until you learn another move. No one ever wants to resort to actually using tackle, and he learns. Tackle at level 20, I think. Yeah, at around level 20. And he evolves at that same They level. just made Magikarp to make people have a grueling evolution to Gyarados. And even Gyarados is kind of Well, I mean, if you actually mad. look at a Gaijin Goomba video, he actually did draw a pretty good parallel. Even then, it's pretty... It's kind of a stretch at best. Yeah, personally, I think... Yeah, let's do a let's drum roll on. and head on to the number one entry. Right. At number one, it's so pretty much everybody who does not agree with Slippy uh, as being completely ignored and useless. Well, he is the mechanic. I think he might be the Star Fox's mechanic. But even then, they're an elite team. Uh, they're think so that if they have a mechanic, they'd get a mechanic that's remotely competent. They're complaining about how he constantly has some guy in his tail. Exactly, and he. How is he not dead? Exactly, and look at the picture. Yeah, it explains it. it explains this that, explains you know, it. That's, okay, the whose side are you on? That's an actual thing. Because I think in one of the games, um, Slippy might have accidentally shot at Falco. Yeah, exactly. And uh, personally, I just think he's incredibly annoying. And oh, I think they made him that way. Yeah, he's just incredibly annoying. He does nothing for the team. Uh, Yeah, it's just... How did he be on that team? I don't know. Personally... Why did Nintendo even make it? Anyway, um, that ends up our, um, top five. Um, our top... This time we're kind of awake. Yeah, we're kind of awake. It's not four in the morning. It's it's ten, it's almost ten at night. (laughs) Yeah, it's almost ten at night. Actually, yes, this, we will see you guys in the next video. It's our top five, uh, Useless slash ignored heroes, still debated. White crayons in video games. Yes, white crayons in video games. Uh, Whatever you want to call it. Post one. what you think is a useless character in the comments. Uh, anyway, uh, we will see you guys in the next video. Yes, sir, if someone says your mom. Hashtag. There's always that one guy in the comments who all comments like your mom. Yeah, that's, that's Illuminati confirmed.